Hi, Scotty Sanders here. You know, there are always two ways. I believe there are always two ways to do things. And here are a few examples, and you may be familiar with these. One would be abundance versus scarcity, or growth or fixed. And I'm talking about mindset there. Love or lust, positive or negative, design or default. What do you think is the biggest challenge for most people? Just think about that for a second. Here it is, they have no plan for the day. Keep in mind that no plan, it's a plan, it's just the worst plan a person can have. Another way to say it is that they have a default plan. They wake up and life just happens. And the next day, they just repeat the same thing. What if I told you that you could have an design plan for each day. You can learn a way to have focus and direction. Many people have a budget, right? A plan to where they spend their personal finances. However, my estimate is that less than 1% have a plan for their day, which is in essence where they spend their time. That's what a, a budget of your time is, having a plan of where you spend your time. What are the elements of a design plan? So here's a few. There's an overall direction. You have an aim. You know what you're shooting for. Another is clarity on the activities for the day. Most people would say, I know I was busy, but have no idea what they actually did during that day. Another one is part of your design plan is going into it with the right mindset. And then one more proper motivators. If you don't have the proper motivators, it's easy to get distracted and start drifting away from the direction you need to go in your life. So let me save you lots of time and money by helping you with a design plan. You'll want to go to lifeonathreeby5.com and check out this incredible resource I have available for you. Remember, there's always two ways so check out my digital course and it can help you with a design plan and it gives you a plan for the day. But listen, until next time, live well and lead well.